time, the thing that you always worry about in a bowl game is people have got three, four weeks to get ready. So how much will they tinker with? How many things will they do that maybe they haven't even put on video? Uh, you know, uh, we've studied most of the games that have schemes that are similar to us, okay? But then we've looked at all the games just to make sure that you don't miss something that they do. But, uh, you know, they're a very talented team. Heck, they're, I think they're a nine and a half point favorite, so we got our work cut out. The scores are somewhat, to be honest with you, about the same. So it tells you an awful lot that, you know, they competed to get somebody that was really good. They scored points. And, uh, you know, so it does. It gives you a little bit of an analogy. But, you know, you really truly, to be honest with you, I mean, you focus more on maybe the last three, four, five games of the season. Once teams get into a, a routine, once they get into a role, they kind of defined who they are. And that's when they're winning their games. That's what you really study. And, uh, you know, and, and we talked about it, you know, from the standpoint that last year, how excited everybody was to go in a bowl game for the first time in a long time, uh, but how disappointed it was to obviously Alex getting hurt, but still, that's not winning the game. So, uh, you know, you don't want to go another nine months, you know, ending the season, you know, with nothing positive. It's not, we had finals last week. We'll probably, we'll probably, we'll probably have close to about 11 or 12. You know, some of them will be walkthroughs and, and probably 10 legitimate real practices. And so for our kids, they're going to get a chance to experience the Bahamian uh, hospitality. I mean, obviously, if, if you've ever been to Atlantis on Paradise Island, there may not be a better resort, you know, any place on the planet, much less, you know, in the Bahamas. So, yeah, I mean, obviously, you got to create game plans in all three phases that give you a chance to win the game. And if there's opportunities to add some things, I know that a lot of teams, you know, they'll come out and do all kinds of crazy things that they haven't done. And sometimes it works and sometimes it backfires. I mean, you better do things that the kids are comfortable with doing and and um, you know because it's really truly about you know making sure that you don't self-inflict like we did in, in the last game against Marshall I mean we beat ourselves I mean we didn't play good in that game so we need to come back and play significantly better and and do the things that we think we can do well